Hi, I'm Jasmine, aka Lady Fresh for Show, and today I'm gonna be cleaning up my eyebrows and I wanted to share how I do it. Today I'm gonna be using the GG Student Starter Wax Kit. It comes with the pre hun pre epilating powder, wax off, and slow grow. Of course, it comes with the wax, wax strips, and wax sticks. The supplies that you will need to wax your eyebrows is cotton pads or cotton balls, whatever you have, an eyebrow brush, scissors, aloe vera gel, and make sure you turn your wax warmer up to about medium heat so you won't burn your skin. All right, so let's get started. First thing, you need to cleanse your eyebrows. So I'm gonna use the pre hun cleanser to clean my eyebrows. And make sure you move your hair out the way. You do not want wax in your hair. This stuff is hard to come out. Then I'm gonna brush my eyebrows so I can get an idea of where I wanna lay the wax. Well, these eyebrows is bushy. It's been a while since I waxed them. All right, you get your wax stick. You can use whatever size wax stick you want to use, but it's normally easier to use the littler wax sticks. And you definitely don't want to get the wax in areas that it's not supposed to be in. So I always use the little wax sticks. I'm going to break my stick in half. Because you do not want to double dip. Anytime you use your wax at home, you need to make sure you don't double dip so you don't have bacteria dipped into your wax. And if you go to a salon and get your eyebrows waxed and they double dip, just don't let them do it. Don't even let them get on your eyebrows. You want to make sure you don't get any bacteria under your skin. So cleanliness is the best way. So I'm just going to draw a line where I want the wax. Lay the strip right on top of the wax. And rip it opposite of the way your hair grows. And I'm gonna brush the eyebrows down. So I can do the top part. Make sure you rip the opposite way of your hair growth. And there's the top. Kind of brush it out so you can see if it's the shape you like it. If it is, you need to go. If you have any hairs missing like right here and right through there, you need to go through with your tweezers because if you Go over it with the wax again, you can rip your skin or burn it, and you don't want to do that. Okay, now I'm gonna tweeze my eyebrows a little bit. All those little hairs that I missed. Get those out the way. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. You gotta have your mouth open just a little bit so you know it's real. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Okay, so that's pretty much the shape. And now I'm gonna um, 
brush the little hairs down. And go in with my scissors. And just cut the shape of the line again. So I can get a sharp eyebrow look. Brush the hairs up. Now I'm gonna go in with my wax off. This is definitely nice. Especially because wax is so sticky. You definitely want some wax off. Wax on, wax off. Okay, so for the last step on the eyebrows, you need to use aloe vera gel. You can just get this at the grocery store. The aloe vera gel, it helps with the redness. And it cools down your eyebrows, which is nice. So this is the finished look. So thanks for joining me watching my how I wax my eyebrows video. If you have any questions, just comment below. I used the honey wax today. That's a whole nother video to different types of waxes you can use. So if you would like a video on how to choose what wax you're gonna use, just comment below. But thanks for joining me. Peace out.